Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel and welcome to part 65 of my Black Widow Challenge. And guess what guys? Aspen has completely mastered out everything for vampires. Um, oh okay we are playing. Uh, discover ultimate vampire cure. Aspen has learned the ultimate vampire secret how to cure vampirism. She can now make the ultimate vampire cure on the bar. There's nothing else for Aspen to learn about vampires. And today's also TV season premiere day. It is day five of 14 of winter. The today's forecast is cloudy and is currently cloudy and cold. Uh, oh wait, the ultimate vampire tells this chapter goes into detail about vampires who walk in the sun. The sunlight reversal cocktail will give temporary immunity train in the sun resistant can survive even longer in the sun. She's still learning stuff, whatever. But we have plenty of plans today. Hey Cairo. Because I have added a lovely event to our calendar. The final wedding for our lovely Whack Widow. So we will be getting married to Melissio today, but we also have a lovely plan for him at the wedding. The wedding will not be until 7 p.m. So we've got plenty of time. I kind of want to take care of TV season <laughs> premiere because Arabella likes his holiday. Um, the girls had actually gone off to school, but I went into Creative Sim to give them their wedding outfits, and when I returned, they loaded back in from school. So whatever, it's fine. Their mom's getting married today, so they're gonna take today off from school. So go ahead and use the bathroom, actually, sweets. Um, you can go ahead and do your homework, because you guys will be going to school tomorrow. Um... And then you, ma'am, yeah, like, come on, guys. Y'all doing all this extra stuff instead of taking care of your needs. The ultimate vampire was mortal once, but, oh, I was reading that. But he, but he was turned immortal through a curse. Oh. Oh, she's learning, like, like, for real ultimate secrets now. So she's like reading the hidden chapters. And then you can go ahead and do your homework as well, sweetie. I have Melissio hibernating because I actually really don't need him around until the um, wedding. But I did invite quite a few of Aspen's ex-lovers so that we could um, have an interesting wedding to be caught cheating as well during the wedding. Because even though he is the last husband, I think we still have to have him catch us cheating but I still have to wait for after the ceremony for all of that to happen. But I'll probably be getting married right away as soon as the we get to the venue. All right, all right, talk to Cairo, yes. Oh, being cute. But I do want you to like drink, ma'am, because you are thirsty. You're a guilty drinker, so you're not really here for the, right. Ooh. Was it good, sweetie? Because you drank that deep. All right. Actually, help Arabella with her homework first. And then we could probably participate. It's almost lunchtime. Um, help with her with homework. Um, we'll probably have, like, close to dinner time. Watch the TV season premiere. Um, Jade, are you done with your homework? Oh, no. You're coming downstairs to do your homework. Okay. Look, family daughter time. Jay usually breezes through her homework. She doesn't always need her mom's help as of lately. So, but they're all going through some form of phase. I think uh, Jade is going through a loud phase, and Arabella is going through a picky eater phase. I'm just—it's a lot going on in this house. Um, I did say that I probably would make over this house at the end of the series. <clears throat> Excuse me, but. I don't think I'm gonna do that anymore because it's been so long and I've kind of actually like how the house is honestly it kind of just fits the style of what I'm going for but um I don't know if this will be the final house I think Aspen will move her girls one more time 
after we get rid of the last husband. And I think that will be the house that will you guys will see the major makeover for. Okay. We helped and both girls look like they're about done with their homework. And since it is cloudy, why won't we take this time and take advantage of this and actually go outside and play with our girl? <gasps> no! Our cow plant! No! <laughs> No, I tried so hard to keep it alive to the very end, but we have plenty of cow plants, but it's going to take a while for it to grow as big as this. I mean, crop plant berries. Ah, this sucks. <laughs> we were doing so well, but I do want you to come out and play with the girls though. Um, I guess we could play in this area. Um and build a snow pal with Arabella. And then I, I don't know why you can't do more than two at a time. And then Jade, I want you to come outside and make a snow angel. I mean, you could at least put on your cold weather wear those sweets. I know you're not really affected by the weather, but let's, try to put on some or at least put on some clothes you, you in your workout outfit because you had a workout this morning because you don't need rest because you've been up since like four o'clock and you're barely tired okay uh right i was waiting for arabella to start get off of it change your clothes and then you can continue all right to continue building snow pal thank you because i don't know why there we go. And the, ah, the Jade's over there making her snow angel. And I think you, after this, will go in and cook dinner for the girls. And then, um, or really like a late lunch. And then you guys will watch TV season premiere together. And then get ready for the wedding. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, miss. I was wondering why you were just standing there. No, 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 continue. You need to do it with your mother. <clears throat> Like, I know you guys want to play with Cairo. I don't know what's wrong with Cairo because she's got food and a litter box. Where are you going, Jade? What do you mean? Uncomfortable, icky plumbing. Oh, I'm sorry. No, stop. Like, you were all the way over there on the other side to shovel snow. What's going on? Are we not going to continue? <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, everything's irritating me right now. My throat and my sims. What are we doing? Build Snow Pal. Build your own Snow Pal. And then I will have Jade do that as well when she finished playing in the snow. Look at her. Hold on. Hey, sweetie, you look adorable. No, don't get up yet. I wasn't done with you. Ugh. I gotta work on getting into position faster. Oh, you go here. I told you to build it over there. Whatever, I don't care. Miss, come over here. Can you join your sister? Aspen, why are you still stuck here? Because you are not doing the slightly bit of movement on getting the snow pile up. Okay. My game is not liking me right now. Because you are still stuck here and you're getting thirsty. Like, come on. Forget that snow pile. I give up on that one. Grab you a drink. The girl, see, the girls are building it together. So, okay, that one's glitchy. We're gonna need to destroy that one. Okay. <sighs> okay. And serve some lunch. Let's serve some Monte Cristo sandwiches for the girls. All right. And they build their lovely snow pal together. Jade is cussing. I'm gonna need for her to watch her mouth. Because I love you, sweetie, but uh, that's a no. 
why can't you guys ever just let me get pictures? You move away too fast. This is why I have to continuously stop everything. Okay, go play. Whatever. Because I want you guys to have snow fun, but you're not staying outside. All right, you cook that up, ma'am. Right, we got to hurry up because we got a few hours left before we really need to start getting ready. Because time goes by so fast, you don't realize it. Mm. And what is Jade up to doing? Okay, go play. You you all want to, you want to be a viol violinist. Lord, I cannot speak. Because you. that's the only thing you ever do on your own is go and play this. Why is your social so low, sweetie? This is why I wanted y'all to do things together. And this is not the type of motherhood I guess Aspen wanted either. She did not want to have to constantly not have to leave the house with her girls like she wants to. They can only go out usually in the afternoons or on days like this when it's cloudy. She did the vampire part because she needed to take down her enemy, but she's kind of regretting. No, you don't need to eat. And why are you eating a sandwich with that? Right. No. Come and grab a... Grab a serving. And... Oh, goodness. Grab a serving. <laughs> And actually, you put that down, and then you can come over here and start watching TV season premiere. And the girls can watch it together, right? Because it's, see, it's almost five o'clock. Are you over here? And then Aspen, not Aspen, Arabella and Jay can join you, especially Miss uh, Arabella, because she loves this tradition. And then Jade, make sure you come over here as well, sweetie. Even though both Aspen and Jade don't care one way or the other toward this holiday, but their family member does, so they're gonna sit around and enjoy it together. Okay, there we go. Let's see, what is it? What is the, ooh, looks like some Grey's Anatomy type thing. Well, I think Grey's Anatomy premieres this week, or was it last week? I don't know. I haven't watched it so long. I used to watch it so religiously, and I haven't watched it in so long. I kind of don't really watch TV as much. I kind of just stick to watching my K-dramas. All right, talk to your mama. Um, Arabella, you are not see-through. Can you sit down? I know it's a big TV, and they, can, they technically can see over you, but please sit down. Thank you. Like, be respectful. <laughs> oh, look at this. This is cute. All right. Right. We definitely have to hurry up and go and take a shower after this is over. Is Jay getting her social up? Okay, she is. Talk to your mama, please. Joke about nacho cheese. Okay, Aspen, that means you taking care of your tradition. I'm sorry, I know I had Jay talking to you, but we've got stuff to do. Right, take a steamy shower. Does he need to take care of any of his needs? He does. Ooh, uh, <laughs> Ooh what did I grab? Oh, I think that was the decoration box. Uh, Take a shower. Arabella, I think you're good. Right, come and take a shower. Come on, everybody. Time to get ready for this wedding. It's almost time. And then Jade, <clears throat> your mom should be out of this soon. So then you can take a shower here. And then we will head off to the place when we get our notification. Hurry up, Arabella. Melissa's come in her bathroom. We got limited bathrooms in this huge house. All right. Jade, come and take a shower real quick. We got like 20 minutes. Come on, sweetie. You Oh, you're too inspired from all the cooking. Fly here's the bag. Get out the bathroom. Oh, I dragged it down here. Uh, no. Oh, I have to move that later. 
I don't like the whole we can drag things. Go take a shower, girl. Come on, we got 10 minutes. You're not that dirty, but I want everybody to have showered for the wedding, please. And of course not, as soon as she gets in the shower. It is time to go. Thanks, Jade. <laughs> wedding is about to begin. Are you ready to start? This will end in a currently running event. Let's start. All right, guys. So here we are at the wedding video. <laughs> and Aspen is getting herself all in the mood. I tried to get everybody here into this lovely, lovely venue that I found off the gallery. I don't remember. I'll have to probably... And the editing product says put the name of the creator because I can't remember if I even saved it to my gallery because I kind of did it right before I did. So I have to probably go look for it again. Anyway, so let's get this underway because this is a lovely place that I replaced a lot that initially was here. The church lot that I said in the last part that we had the last two, the first two husbands funerals at. So this church is the replacement for it. And I figured why not get married on that same lot to the last husband. So go ahead and get married to a Melissio Dark Soul Aspen, please. And thank you, baby. Let's have this lovely last ceremony. Home skillet. You're not going to go sit down? Like, I appreciate you being here, but you are all in my space for pictures. Let me actually be this way because if someone walks across my screen, I'm gonna be upset. See the girls are over there being nice and not getting in my way. Unlike Mister, like, do you not want the wedding to happen? I mean, I could use you for cheating purposes. Just so. And because it is TV season, um holiday there is no gold event for this wedding which is fine by me i'm kind of over i did say i wanted a big wedding just by in the sense i wanted it to be at an actual venue and guests arriving and all that stuff because the last few husbands i think we kind of just did quickie weddings girls why are you getting up sweets jade is cussing in the background i cannot with her <laughs> oh look at them being cute. We got past lovers and romantic interest, interest as all our guests, and I think maybe one or two friends. Are they done? So it's like, I don't think we got a kiss. Oh, sweetie, your wig is snatched. Did I remove your hair? Oh, I did. <laughs> My bad. Uh, I've been removing, going through a lot of removing the CC process, so a lot of my sims are kind of bald and naked. <laughs> my bad. But let me get a good angle this way. Right, because I kind of want the arch and stuff. There we go. That's a good one. Yas. Look at my baby. She's doing it for the last husband. Okay, they already moved in. So, okay, let's... Oh, I for completely forgot the cake. Off a road. But you know what? I did hire plenty... Hold on. I did hire a, mute, like a mixologist, a caterer, all of that. Let me see. Looks like we had nothing. <laughs> So much for the big wedding. Oh my gosh, that sucks. I know I hired people. And what you want, Eliza? I forgot I invited you here. Okay, there's our mixologist. Oh, goodness gracious. Ooh, oh, 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 excuse me. I didn't know we had all of this down here. And then it goes up. Oh, it goes up here over to the kitchen. Okay. Well, then, where is our caterer? Oh, we got guests outside, too? I've noticed that lately with my weddings that guests stand outside of the venue and watch ceremonies instead of inside. Anyway, let me hit play. I'm just... I was trying to find 
our caterer. We got no cake to cut. But look at everybody. Okay, we're good. Okay. Why is this a group conversation? Okay, it's Eliza joined it for what? Hi. What you doing? All right. But I need for Aspen to do me a lovely favor, though, is to actually go downstairs and kick this misologist off the bar because I need you to make a lovely drink first for our... Sir, wait, is this the only bar on this lot? Because if that's the case, it's a slight problem. Because everybody's going to order drinks now, and I need for Aspen to be able to make a drink. Um, come talk to your friend whose wig is snatched. I'm sorry, sweetie. I forgot I deleted your hair. Right in her day. But at least she still got baby hairs on. Who are you talking to, Arabella? Oh, that's your, um, like, your toddlerhood friend's father who your mom had a thing with. I guess y'all both enjoy TV season premiere. Okay, have fun with that. But no, like, for real. Uh, dang. Okay, I'm gonna have to kick my colleges off because I need to be able to make a drink. Where is my Black Widow into this? Um, come, oh. I was telling you to go talk to your friend. What? Where are we? Oh my goodness. Guys! I let you off for a slight second. Really? Hold on. You freshnesses. Look at these two. Aspen. I cannot. Because <laughs> I need you to get rid of him tonight or uh, weaken him a little bit tonight. And you over here woo him with him in the bush. I cannot with you. <laughs> Come on. All right. Y'all didn't have the wedding cake. So y'all was like, we don't got no cake. So let's. Okay, I can't see. And then y'all go outside. I know y'all not have. And then, wait a minute. Hold on, where, how far are you guys from the venue? In the blizzard too. It's like a whole blizzard going on in Windenburg right now and y'all went all the way to the bush and there's beds on the lot. Ugh, I cannot. Why you as a bat? I cannot with you. Ugh, Aspen, you stress me out sometimes, but I love you all the same. <laughs> Okay, so go ahead and make drink. Make drink for Melissio. And he's not up there because he's not here. Okay. Um, Teleport here is a miss. You ask and him, he's going to probably not request the drink I want you to make him. Do I want... Did I want to give him that or did I want to give him? Yeah, I did. I didn't want to. I was, the other one is something else I want to give her. But the ultimate vampire cure, which she actually just learned. And we have. And that's why it's been a couple days since the last part as well. Because we had to grow all of this lovely stuff. The garlic, the wolf spain. We already had plasma fruit. But we had to get it all. So make all make that drink. And we're gonna, I'm gonna ha act like you're making him a drink for him. And he's gonna drink it, not realizing what the drink is. Go ahead, girl. Make that drink, girl. She's tempted to make it for herself, but not yet. She has to take care of this guy first before she does it. I got. I got. Go ahead, girl. Show off. Like, you probably shouldn't be tasting it. But yes, girl. Go ahead. Have fun. Yes. Okay, make the drink. Put it down and don't drink it. Okay. That looks disgusting. Like, is that the drink? That looks hideous. That looks... Oh, and is the green smog coming from it? Ew. Sorry, but Melissio, 
drink it, sir. Chug it. Chug it. He's not going to realize what it is. We're going to act like, ooh, ooh. And he, he one-shotted it, too. Is anything going to happen? <gasps> oh, no. Oh, of course, and I had let it. Ugh, love it. No, I missed it. M ah, you guys are in the way. Melissio Darto has left the undead life behind and is no longer a vampire. He didn't do nothing. And he still has a vampire plum bob. Did he drink it? Ah, uh, and I don't have any more of that stuff. All right, so let's see. Can she do? <gasps> she can drink his plasma! Compel for a deep drink. He's no longer a vampire. Compel him for a deep drink. Or oh, no, 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 no. This is what I want you. Oh, you're already doing it. Ah, no. Hold on. Wait a minute. I actually want. Can you? Because can you do that instead? Drain his life spirit. Yes, that's what I wanted. I'm sorry, sweets. This is not what I needed. There we go. More choices. Vampire. Drain life spirit. That's what I was trying to do. I don't know why I clicked just drink blood. Okay. All right. Drain his life spirit, ma'am, please. And thank you. Yes! I'm sorry. I'm pausing a whole lot. I, just, I told you guys I need my screenshots. This is the ending moment for my Black Widow. I need all of these screenshots of the lovelies. Uh, yeah, there we go. All right. And now she's going to drain his life spirit. Yes, girl. Go ahead and drain it. Oh, yes. Yes. Pull it from him, girl. Pull it. He pulled the life spirit from your sister. So you're going to do the same for him. And I love how we're able to do this in the basement away from the girls. They attended the wedding. Oh, he needs to catch us cheating. But he's not. He doesn't die right away from draining the life spirit. He just will be very successful to dying after this. Oh, yes. Perfect. Perfect. And then I need for her to go and get flirty with someone after this. This takes a long time. She's definitely feeling guilty from it, but he has to go down. Oh my goodness, this is taking a very long time. Where are the girls? Uh, Oh, because the wedding is still going on. Oh, I... Oh, I forgot. I turned free will off so the girls are not taking care of themselves. Okay. Go. Sorry, girls. You, <laughs> they just been sitting here chilling. Go take care of your needs. All right. And we're done. Thank you, sweetie. A lot just happened just now at the wedding. And he's down. And then once he wakes up, we will go and get caught cheating hopefully he will wake up before the wedding's over where is the gentleman i was looking for no that's not him he was the one that was standing in front of everybody there he is how you doing boo um can we move thank you game this is why i gotta pause because nobody wants to keep still um, thank him for coming. There we go. So we can at least start talking to him. I think he's coming downstairs too. Perfect. Everybody disappeared while she was doing all her little stuff to Melissio. And now <laughs> they're all coming back downstairs. Go talk to him. Thanks for coming. 
and stop irritating me, Aspen. Please move. Brighten his day. Um, discuss color theory, and you know what we need to do because I don't want any issues of him alluring visage. We need to turn that on because he look like he's uncomfortable already, and he's not right. Turn on your alluring facade, sweet. Turn it on. Because it's not like you really want the boy. You just need for him to be able to come to you easily. Ask him about his day. And then romance. Kiss. Look, see, he's already flirting back with her just being in the area. You were just flirting. Did you just reject us? Oh, okay. Um, embrace him. Okay, good, good, good. Melissio, hurry up and wake up, sir. Flirt. Everybody's getting... <laughs> we have Gavin getting pulled in, too. Pick up line. Melissio, how much longer are you going to be out, sir? Oh, he's going to be out for a minute. He is out for real. Oh, oh, he's still feeling some of the effects of still being... Oh, no, no, no. That's from being bitten. Right, because nobody asked you to come and join this conversation. You're trying to flirt. She's not here for you. Um, Mean. Is it under me? Yeah, go away. Like, she was not trying to talk to you. Um, flatter him. Like, go away, Gavin. This facade was not for you. I know you got installed in it, but it's not for you, sweet. Like, go away. Thanks. Uh-oh. <laughs> She's pulling all of them in. Like, she can't control. Uh. She's pulling them all in for this, and it's getting ridiculous. Right. She's, uh, okay, and Melissio is not up. Ugh, this is uh, He's gonna be out for quite some time. This is taking so long, and she just keeps pulling him in all of these men after men after men, and she's trying to control it, but she can't. <laughs> but guys, I think I am going to go ahead and end this lovely part right here because, like I said, Melissio is gonna be out for a while. So in the next part, we will be getting rid of our 10th husband. So if you enjoyed this part of my Black Widow Challenge, please go ahead and leave a comment down below. Hit that like button because you know you want to. Subscribe if you haven't and hit that bell button so you'll get notified every time I upload a video. And until next time, guys, bye. Would you believe me if I said I'm in love? Want you to want me Would you believe me?